with animals, dogs, cats, horses, we work from the hindquarters forward. These animals are generally energy driven, so to speak. They're pro they propel themselves through life from the hindquarters. So that's where we generally work from back to front on our four-legged animals. The first chakra that we're gonna talk about is the root chakra. In our animals, this is located at the tail head or the base of the spine. So again, the first chakra, chakra. The color associated with it is the color red. And we, when we look at where this is on the body, we're dealing at the base of the skeleton, the base of the spine, and things come out there. So elimination processes are associated with the root chakra. The adrenal glands are primary gland associated with the chakra, as well as some references will talk about reproductive organs. And in my mind, it's because when you start life, you are born and you basically pass through that root chakra. The emotions associated with the root chakra are generally the stress responses. You can think of it as fight or flight, the will to live, how grounded are you? Basically, it's all about the life force. When you have a person that says, boy, I just, you know, I'm, I'm not connected, or you have an animal that's really scared and can't seem to figure out where they want to go or what they want to do, we may be looking at an imbalance with the root chakra. Some of my favorite oils to work with when we're dealing with the energetics of this particular chakra is a blend called grounding. The name pretty much says it all. We want to be connected to the earth and know where we are, where our roots are, and so that we can feel solid, grounded, and move forward. Vetiver is another one. When we look at where this oil is produced from the root of the plant, again, take that energy, take that frequency, and apply it to the root chakra and get some balance going there, and we'll be a lot happier. The oil Ylang Ylang is a great balancing oil for both male and female energies. I look at Ylang Ylang for any situation basically where we need to balance out whatever may be going on. Rose is another good oil, very, very high frequency. Sometimes we really need to increase the frequency of the body and this can be a good one to think about when we start at the root chakra start increasing the frequency, that energy can move throughout all the chakras in the body. Mm -hmm.